So if you found some way to harness all of that, oh my gosh, this is, I mean, I can't, who can imagine what that is? Can you create universes? Can you, I mean, who knows? I don't know. I can't think that far ahead. What I do know is that it would be awesomely dangerous <laughs> as any new access to energy has always become when in the hands of bad actors on the geopolitical stage. So what this has done is enabled some people, some colleagues of mine, to say, if there's a civilization type two controlling all the energy of its host star, would we be able to see that in our data? So why should a star-spanning civilization be visible at all? We expect to see it because physics is unforgiving about energy. Use it and you must dump waste heat. A society wrapped in a star and machinery, whether mirrors, habitats, or power collectors, conserves energy but not entropy. The starlight they intercept would reemerge as infrared glow. That's why astronomers have searched sky surveys for stars that look oddly dim in visible light, yet bright in the mid-infrared. Across millions of sources, we've found compelling natural culprits. Dust, star formation, active galactic nuclei, but no unambiguous examples of deliberate...